What's up guys, Super Car Blondie here in a supercar scrapyard in Dubai. And we've got a Ferrari <laughs> just being delivered right now. And this is gonna be its new home for a little while. So let's check it out. A lot of people talk about abandoned supercars in Dubai. We are where those abandoned supercars and the damaged supercars go to rest. California tea, just sitting here. This is where damaged supercars or cars that have been confiscated by the police or abandoned supercars come. And that's what we're gonna take a look at today. Just find the nicest supercars that have ended up in a scrapyard, a junkyard in Dubai. The cool thing is you can actually buy them. All of these go on auction online and you can put in a bid and get a bargain. California tea, I've had a look at the secondhand market here in Dubai. The cheapest California tea you can buy at the moment is around $100,000. It's a 2015 model with about 22,000 kilometers on the clock. This one here, Rohan, this is Rohan, guys. So the starting bid of this one will be like $30,000. Wow. Yeah. So you've actually looked at a lot of yes, the auctions yes. and you've seen how much lower they yeah. sell for. So starting bid about $30,000. 30, but what do you reckon it would actually end up at? Uh, it depends on your luck. Like, yeah. if you're lucky enough, you could get it for like 40. If you're lucky enough, if what? no one bids. <laughs> A California tea for $40,000. From the outside, it actually looks in perfect condition. There's like nothing wrong with this one. This one is here probably because someone couldn't pay a debt. Maybe it was seized by the mm -hmm. bank. There are other cars over the years that have literally just been abandoned by owners on the side of the road because they couldn't pay their debts and they had to leave the country straight away. So you've got cars like this here and then you've got cars like this. Rolls Royce Wraith and look at this side. Oh my God, just breaks your heart, doesn't it? Look at this, look at the damage on this. Oh, imagine being in an accident like this. Oh my God. Drive safe, guys. This is, this is the result. It's going to fall apart. I feel like the whole thing's just going to collapse. Now just open it. Now that's it. Okay, you can. I think spare part companies will use the seat. Oh my God. The door, look at this. The door can still open. That's all right. That's pretty impressive. Yeah, look at the seats. Like you've got this beautiful leather here, the perforated leather, and that is for air conditioning through the seats. This is the same spec as my Rolls Royce. Wow, that actually sends it home a little bit. Like this could, this could, you know, happen. That's really scary. Secondhand market Rolls Royce Wraith. I've been looking at the cheapest one you can get. Uh, it is currently a 2014 model with 50,000 kilometers on the clock and it goes for about $125,000. That's the cheapest Wraith you can get at the moment. This one goes for $2. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, look, there's another Rolls Royce here. Oh, boom. That's why this one hasn't sold. They're like, oh, I want this one. Um, look, they lowered it as well. Look, it's a low rider Rolls. Oh my God. Is that not just from the accident? No, no, it's a low. <laughs> Pimped out. It's a quick way of getting a lowered, lowered uh, chassis. Wow, okay. Okay, so here's a, another Wraith. Nice spirit of ecstasy. You can see that here. I wonder if it pops out of that. It's probably... No, it's a bit broken, that one. Uh, okay. Oh, it's nice. What? Wow. Do the smell test. Yeah, smells good. Look at these plush carpets and stuff. Wow, this is a beautiful spec. However, I do have some insider knowledge on this one. Apparently it's got some flood damage. I'm not sure how much money you'd have to spend to fix that kind of damage, but from the outside, it looks pretty clean. And the inside's beautiful. But yeah, it's obviously got some issues. You'd take this one? I would take this would one. It, would it matter if it I could drive or you'd just have it sitting I in just, your garage? I could have an extra parking space. Yeah. This is sick. <laughs> I, I own a Rolls Royce. Oh yeah, where is it? Oh, it's downstairs in my parking I'll space. I'll take it. I don't want to run up the kilometers, you know. It's, you know, just keep it low mileage. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it just sits there. I love it. All right, this. Wow. 
this is I've never seen anything like this before. So Hurricane, Lamborghini Hurricane. I used to have one of these babies. Her name was Lucy. Imagine if she was in this condition. This is shocking. All right, let's have a look what's going on here. This one, really, I think people have given up on this because this has been here for a couple of years now. It is well and truly just molded into the ground that it sits on. Look at this. Clearly hasn't moved in so long. Look at the badge is gone. Look at this. <laughs> just hanging limp on the side of the car. All right, let's see what it looks like inside, if it's just as bad as the outside. Door works. It's lost. Oh my God. <gasps> tragedy. When the feeling's gone and can't go on, it's tragedy. Oh. even come off at this point wow do you think Chris fix it could fix it god knows it's like it's been rained on how is this even possible how do you get a car this dirty look at all of these like water marks everywhere look it's just like streaming down here oh that's why yeah th so this has been open for a while so the rain just comes straight in oh my god <laughs> what so this one doesn't look too bad until you get to the front. Uh, this wheel is just like, obviously, completely carved it on another angle here. The front badge, Mercedes is like, we want nothing to do with this car. We're just going to take the badge away. <laughs> no longer a Mercedes. What are we going to find? Dun, dun, dun. Oh. It's not too bad, is it? Look, the airbags are out. Obviously, it's been an accident here. So these are the side airbags. This one doesn't look like it came out. That's interesting. This one here. It's got airbags everywhere. This is beautiful Alcantara here. And other than that, it's in pretty good condition. It's just very dusty. Look, what's in here? Is there anything in the glove box? Maybe we're going to find cash. No cash. What is it? Oh, a hair clip! Bonus! Guys, I found a free hair clip! <laughs> Sweet! I found a hair clip! Oh, nice. Yeah, nice, right? That's not scary or anything. <laughs> Did it open? I swear it's just like noise. Oh! Oh, Swarovski. Oh, oh a business card. Pretty, it's not actually Swarovski's. C certificate of Authenticity. Let's find the actual Swarovski now. Come on, Sergi, get in there, mate. This is Come pretty on. scary, man. I don't Come want on. anything to do with this. Look at this, all here on the side. Never seen that before. What's actually hiding here behind these panels in the boot? Wow, needs a bit of a clean, but she'd be right. Let's move on. We've got a couple of Gs down here. Another a Ferrari, California T, just sitting here. The interior is pretty good, you guys. Look. It's actually in not bad condition. I wonder what's wrong with this one. Because the exterior is quite good as well. And then you've got this G here. It looks, uh, it looks good. No major exterior damage. So let's see what's inside. You just never know what you're going to get. Ready? Oh yeah, it's not bad, but look. It's just like all of this water, like water drops, water marks all here on the steering wheel. It's a bit damaged down here, but it's not bad all in all. Something fishy about this one. It must have been, look, that window is missing. Other than that, you're good to go. Look at this one, another G. Oh man, look at this. Wow, look at this carbon fiber. Oh my God, I have to get in this one. This is too nice. Wow, 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 it's brand new. It's a new G-Wagon. Look, it's got the big screen here in the front. One glass panel that goes all the way across. Oh my God, that's crazy. 
Look how good condition this is. Not somewhere you would expect to find a brand new G-Wagon in this kind of condition uh, here in a scrapyard. I mean, look at this. In the middle of nowhere. Yeah. And into the front. Yes. Wow. Well. Yeah, exactly. How does this driver even see out, you guys? Look how tinted it is. Literally, that is like 100% tinting. I can't see anything. And then look at the front here. The same. <laughs> how are you meant to see out of this car? Yes, we've got a 612 Scalietti here. And uh, actually, it's in good condition. I've not seen anything really on this one again how much can you buy this car for on the second hand market the cheapest one i can find at the moment is a 2006 model with almost 70,000 k on the clock and you can get it for just over sixty thousand dollars see if we can find more hair clips look at the condition wow this is great condition that's what happens oh there's gum oh how fun Grace, how do you open this thing? Oh, does it not have one? There might be like a dead spider or something. No, okay. Whew. It's under here. What? You're kidding me. <laughs> no way. Cash? Cash in an abandoned supercar. This is about, this is 500 dirhams, so what, 100 and... 50 bucks, 150 bucks. Great, we can go home. Actually, we can buy a few cars with this amount. I've been in a lot of abandoned cars, but I've never found any money. Which car do we want to buy? I mean, you could buy this thing. <laughs> we could buy that Lexus over there, maybe. That's crazy, guys. <laughs> All right, we planted it, fine. Didn't really happen. <laughs> Escalade, come to here to die. Take it final resting place <laughs> actually who knows someone might buy that Mercedes literally just got dropped off that second oh okay maybe you don't want this one <laughs> looks fine from the other side hello that's why it's here wow okay make sure before you buy the car to look at it from all the angles <laughs> from the front I was like yeah that's all right all right okay let's see how much that one sells for Ouch. Look at that rim damage. I mean, that takes some kind of impact. Wow. Wow, this is a new style G-Wagon. Never seen one like this before. Oh. oh my God. This looks like it's rolled. All the airbags out on the side. You've got, oh, look at this, just what a waste. Like these screens. I mean, this is, I suppose, not a waste, right? People can reuse them and that's why you buy something like this but look at this wow oh, it's even a g63 yeah wow oh look look at this side it's just like the leaning tower of Pisa 